the Michigan Delta Peninsula. Um, I've lived here about half of my life, also in northern Wisconsin, so I'm very deeply connected to this region. I also work for the Cumana Bay Indian community as mining technical assistant. My job is to review and comment on mining permit applications, and um, we've reviewed the Urbana Copperwood project. One of the number one concerns we have with this, which is um, very astonishing that there's a lot of um, perceived trust and confidence that there's not going to be environmental impacts. Um, but the tailings disposal facility, which could be avoided, the company could backfill the tailings um, to reduce an on-surface impact that would reach 14 stories high, 140 feet, fill in over 13,000 feet of stream, and almost 60 acres of wetlands that could be avoided. Under the Federal um, Clean Water Act, the process is that um, first the company must avoid the impacts, then minimize, and then mitigate. Um, we need to back up to the very first step and avoid these impacts. Um, it's industry standard in technically advanced countries such as the United States of America, and it's best management practices. And this community deserves that. They are putting a lot of trust into your agency to make sure that um, impacts aren't left here long into the future um, because it's going to be their grandchildren and their taxpayer dollars that are going to have to pay for treatment if there are perpetual care problems with heavy toxins, heavy, heavy metals and other contaminants leaking out of this tailing, tailing disposal facility near Lake Superior. Um, also, um, there's scholarly studies out there that show that consistently across the board, mining communities are not prosperous. There's a phenomenon known as boom and bust. Um, and I just want to throw that out there just um, for my concern for us to start thinking in a mindset that we're going to start building the foundations necessary for long-term sustainable communities and healthy communities and not short-term jobs where with this project, I believe it's only about 14 years. And I would hate to see um, the community be left worse off after the mine people are laid off at the close of the mine. So I just really encourage leadership to think about the foundations necessary um, that we all care about. Thank you.